today we are going to go visit Zap Comics. So I hope you can come along and we can check out this comic shop and see if this is a honey hole or not. Do they have the comics we need? Do they have the books we want? And do we ha they have the books that we like? I've been here before. It's a well put together shop. And here we have Predator and Archie are fighting and Archie is having a bad day. Archie has no head. The Predator has his head. Now if we're going to go out here, that means I got to get in my car because we got to drive. So come along and let's go. front of Zap. I was going to go inside, check it out, get some books. Um, they got a really great store out here. So uh, they usually have a package of uh, issues that I like. It's like um, they put them together like uh, a whole series, like House of M or something like that. So I think it's kind of cool. So I thought I would uh, film it, check it out, go into the comic book store. And uh, it's right behind us over here. I don't know if you can see it. This is Zap. They get it in, but uh, it's a really cool store. I'm gonna go check it out. See what they got in there. Got a lot of good deals. All right, we got here pretty quick, right? Here we are, coming to the front. Let's see what kind of posters they got out here. All right, they got some cool stuff. They got Punchline, they got the Eternals, a little death metal. Let's see if this place is a honey hole or not. Let me know in the comments below if this is your spot. If this is a good place to get books. All right, let's go in. Let's check it out. All right, right in the front here, we got some uh, cool back issues. Batman, some New 52. Batman Adventure Continues. Oh, here's a cool book right here. Batman Adventures. That animated series. <laughs> On the left here, they have these comic sets. That's why I like this place. That's why I came in here. Oh, look at this Daredevil. 
It's good shape, huh? Number 40, 10 bucks. It's in great shape. But you know what with that Mylar? Sometimes the Mylar makes these books really pop, makes them look a lot better than they are. But a lot of those old Daredevils, you know, they look really terrific. But um, you always see those around, right? They're, like, really affordable. It's surprising when you see them. But uh, there's a guy at the counter talking to the uh, manager. He was here. I came here two months ago. The same guy was here. It's like that movie High Fidelity. Some people just hang out in the comic book store. I think this guy's here all the time. Free comic book day. It's uh, Usagi Ojimbo. They got a Jack Kirby book. This year they actually had some good books for free comic book day. This guy's talking about He-Man by the account of the history of He-Man. Last time I was here, I think he was talking about the importance of Black Flag. How they changed uh, various genres. I remember that. I remember that guy was here talking about that. Here's some uh, trade paperbacks. Some hardcovers. Look, they got a whole section of sketch covers. Isn't that cool? These are current back issues here. I dug in there for a while because uh, I had some holes in some recent uh, storylines I was reading. There's some uh, more trade paperbacks here and some uh, omnibus and stuff. And then they have a really nice old school wall, man. You know? Like the old school walls where people showed off some books, put up some Silver Age and Bronze and gold, Golden Age. You know? it's A lot of stores don't do this anymore. It's really cool to see that. And the wall's full. He filled it up here, man. Oh, look at that Spider Man 700. And on the left, uh, there's some more uh, back issues. It's got a healthy uh, back issue lot here. Got some t-shirts. They got some uh, solo figurines and statues, and some box statues, some toys. They had a lot of uh, those Funko Pops in the front. Nice uh, trade paperbacks. But this uh, new issue selection is terrific, huh? I mean, they are stocked. Today is a uh, New Comics Day, and they have the uh, three Jokers you saw there, right? It just came out. Let's go back to this old wall here, where they're showing it off. Right, right? more uh, comic shops should do this. Put some uh, big boy books on the wall. Some Flash. Those tales to tales to astonish how terrific those they look, right? So cool. Got a uh, Batman, Death in the Family, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Look at this. Yeah, some G.I. Joes. Alright, Godzilla. Or as it's properly said in Japan, Gojira. Alright, I love to see these old school walls, right? It never gets old. Look at this 700, man. This is signed, man. Who is that, Posima? I can't see it. It's hard to read signatures sometimes, right? I need the wall. Alright. This is uh, like the sets I was talking about. This is a Captain America set. And this is uh, Ed Brubaker run, right? Look at that. It's terrific, right? Put like eight books in there for like ten bucks. Charlie's Angels. Look at these uh, Convergence uh, one-shots. All in one set. Look at this. What is that? Zero, one to eight. Twelve bucks. Right? It's a good deal, man. Some good, some really cool reading material. He puts it together like the uh, the shop is really curated. Like he puts together some good ideas, some good uh, story uh, arcs, some runs, good reading material. I want to put you guys right in this long box. See the can't get you right in there. It's like three D. I want to hit you with the books. 
All right, I got to work on my camera technique, right? I'm getting a little too close. I got to work on my camera skills. Camera shaking too much. I'll try to back up, right? Looks like these sets are selling out. This box is getting light. Last time I was here, I think it was like two or three months ago, I picked up some good books. And, uh, I saw... Oh, Eternity Girl. Oh, man, I want this run. This was, uh, Comics Gate versus the, uh, SJWs, right? It was the worst book in the world, or it was the greatest book ever written. Right? It was just nonstop fighting for a while there. But, uh, I don't know, I heard that was pretty cool. She's like a uh, superhero, she can't die. It's like Groundhog Day. She keeps trying to kill herself. Oh, here's a, a good flash run right here. I wanted that House of M. I saw it here last time. Let's see if they have it. And I wanted that... Uh, I think they had a cool Green Lantern. Uh, hack. Oh, here's Green Lantern right here. Oh, here we go. Here's the uh, Green Lantern corpse. Recharge. Oh, it's Jeff Johns. Is this it? Is this the good run? Six bucks. Damn, I'm gonna run out of money here. Oh, here's another one. Green Lantern Corpse Rebirth. Oh man, I don't know which ones. I should have wrote it down, right? Which is the one that, um... There's, another, there's too many Green Lantern... Right, there's too many runs nowadays. Green Lantern New 52. Oh, this is it right here. This is it. This is the Jeff Johns and the uh, Ethan Van Skyver. This is it right here. Oh, this is awesome, man. Look at this. Put it together for you in a pack. What was that, 10 bucks? 1 to 8? Or oh, 1 to 7? What is this one? This Infinity Crusade is everywhere, huh? This set? Oh, this Hawkman. Should I get this? Let me know in the comments below what's the good Hawkman. People are saying, uh, I forgot what series. Is this the Rebirth? Is this the uh, good one to get? Look at this. 15 bucks. This one to eight. I'm going to get crazy in here. Because I already bought a bunch of new books already. And I got my pile. I got to add this up. Shop's awesome, man. Thanks, man. Well, Firepower's already on the wall. <laughs> That's a special variant. Oh. I won't film you. I'm just... Uh... Oh, yeah, it's all good. He's got an awesome store here. Thank you, man. We try our best. We have another store up in Wayne as well. That is another one? Mm-hmm. I didn't know that. Yeah, we're like the child store uh, to the... To the um, to the uh, to the Wayne store. The Wayne store is the parent. All right. Well, let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Here's some more uh, figurines and some glasses, some solo statues, uh, some Funko Pop. And I'm going to head out. So that was it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll put some of the, uh, the hunt uh, after this with some music because I didn't want to... Uh, take too long. We're going over time, right? I will see you next time in my next video.
Ay, bueno. God. 